Hello fellow players, my name, you know it, it's player himself now. So this is this video is just going to be a bit of a channel update for you guys. Um, I know, I mean, my videos have been a little bit different recently, so I want to clear some things up. First thing you'll see, as I mentioned already, is the uh, I just changed the branding of my channel a little bit. So if you don't know who player himself is, well, you'll see on the screen. This is me before, this is me afterwards. Uh, I do like my new profile pictures now. Uh, I know it's a bit strange, but uh, the gorilla is pretty cool. It's a cool it's a cool animal. I mean, I don't think you can argue with that. So uh, yeah. I have also settled on the name player himself. I know you guys pretty much answered like unanimously. Uh, you preferred that name over anything else that I propose uh, at the very least. So this is when, what I went for. And I also kind of when I, when I made this poll, I sort of hoped that you guys would pick Player himself, so I'm really happy about the name. But why why am I changing my channel branding? If you've been following my channel for a little bit, I think you know why. Or just like YouTube, you frag on YouTube in general, everyone's leaving frag. I'm not leaving because everyone's leaving. Um, we're all leaving because of the same reason. The game is... It's, it's getting pretty bad, okay? There's a many, many things that is making the game worse and worse by the update and it's because they're not changing the things that we are as content creators or just players in general we're crit criticizing um, and I want to I want to I've already made a video about this like a few months ago so you can go check it out on the link up here um, I think it went over everything that's wrong about the game uh, for now I mean like since I've been since maybe a year my views have been like constantly pretty much at the same place and even have gone up but that's not because uh, frag on youtube is being more popular i just think that's i just think that's because people that found my channel are sort of deeper in the frag algorithm and will tend to stay in the game longer uh, and i know some of you also have been sticking around uh, in the channel watching my frag videos even though you're not playing frag so i want to thank you for that but also like i, I just want to say it, uh if while I'm doing a channel update video, I just appreciate everyone that has been uh, watching my frag videos for a long time. I mean, I've been doing this stuff for like a year and a half, and it is pretty crazy to think that because I mean, look, time flies, man. Um, I, I am still very proud about what kind of videos I did, even though I'm not going to be staying. I mean, I wasn't going to do frag videos forever. I know that day was was going to come where I had to like try some new things, but like I, I just want to make some some honorable mentions I, I don't need to toot my own horn but some of the videos like the AI championship videos are probably my favorite ones uh, ever I did on my channel because I think it was a really great idea uh, it was a very very fun collab with Lord T which I, I really appreciated and um, I mean I, I think I did a pretty good job with the editing it, it was a whole lot of fun but I want to also like uh, shout out my most viewed video top 10 best mains which is really hilarious because so many people saw it but 99% of the people who saw it saw it when it wasn't even applicable like the meta had completely changed when they saw it but they just I don't know just wanted to see it and I look I, I'm not I said it in the comments right like the meta has changed but I mean look it's what the <laughs> it's, it's what the frag community wants to see I guess top 10 videos that are not uh, even true so yeah um also, some of some of my, some of, my, uh, some of the, the videos I really like to do. Uh, all the collabs I did were a whole lot of fun. I wanted to shout out Space Unicorn recently for the new uh, tier list videos. That was a whole lot of fun. A lot of work to edit, but I think it was a, like some of my best, um, some of my highest quality videos maybe, um, in terms of information and in terms of editing. And you know, some of my first videos as well. The top 15 quick exposed bunker destroyers who can uh, jump over the, the pit map, which was my first video to get a thousand views. I think no, that was actually the floor is lava. Anyway, yeah, I mean, uh, look, I'm just happy about what I did on the frag community, and I'm happy a lot of people seem to enjoy it as well. And I want to keep going, not with frag though, because I think that frag, um, it, it's it's led by a company that is too greedy. And look, honestly, like. I can understand it you guys want money to have a company that works but you're sacrificing i think a lot of values that the company needs to have a game that's successful 
If you want to build a game that lasts a long time and that people enjoy and want to play, you need to make it fun, okay? That's your main, main, main goal as a company. It's not about money, okay? And look, I get capitalism equals money. We want money to have a company that works. I get, I get it, but at some point you have to prioritize things. Uh, you have to prioritize making a game good for the, the common per, the common player, not just the pay to win. And Frag OBB has been only, and I mean, only doing things for the pay to win for like almost a year. We we just see update after after update, and it just keeps getting worse, worse and worse. The pay to win players get rewarded all the time, and the free to play they just get stepped on. And look, it just it just sort of like when that happens, you have to expect people to leave. That's what's been happening. The views on YouTube have been getting down for a lot of people. Therefore, the content creators are out. Um, for me, it's more or less like I've been thinking recently and I don't want to, because as a content creator, obviously the videos I make encourage people to, to download the game, try it. And I don't think that's the right thing because a game should be something that you, you know, when you're tired and you're looking for a bit of a, a bit of fun before going to bed or something, or you're, you're in break at work and trying to do something fun so that uh, you can get back to work with more energy. Uh, when you're just trying to calm down, these are these are situations where you want to play a game, and the things that you want a game to do for you, Frag doesn't. Frag doesn't do that. Frag, uh, I mean, it just makes you angry, uh, makes you disappointed, and makes you, I mean, addicted to some degree. Although most games do, uh, as well. But yeah, I mean, with the with the with how Frag has changed over the years. It's really not interesting to make content on the game. It's not really rewarding either because, uh, I mean, I kind of feel like I'm try I'm making content for a game I don't really like, you know. So yeah, uh, th this is enough of my speech about like a f frag and as a content creator how I feel about it. While the time has passed, I have gotten what I wanted from from this frag YouTube experience. I mean, I've learned a lot of things, how to make consistent videos. A lot of work ethic and creativity that goes into it. I think I've gotten better at it. Obviously, speaking in front of a camera or in, in front of a microphone, I could not do, I mean, nearly as good as I did before. And obviously, number one, I was able to make uh, a lot of videos that a lot of people want, uh, enjoyed, uh, which was very, very nice. Now, with all that, it's not all that experience is not going down in the gutter, right? I'm still gonna be on YouTube. And honestly, I'm still going to be making YouTube videos on Frag as well. It's not over. I not I, I think quitting the game is a bit of an aggressive step since I've played the game for two years. I've been making videos for one year and a half. Just because I've been a bit tired of the game doesn't mean that it can't change. I just don't have that much hope. Um, so that's why I'm sort of like not quitting the game per se. But as a whole, you know that I'm not going to be making as much videos for the last three updates. I have only played one day, one day per month, which was when the new character released. I think I'm still going to do live stream on this character, but you know the, the events to unlock the new characters have been getting pay to win like crazy. So as I was able to unlock Strix, but it was like borderline and it it's getting more borderline by the update. <laughs> so maybe one day I'm not going to be able to do it. Um, I will try new games, as you know, and I want to look. I want to try to make videos for a game that I actually enjoy and that I think I can do it long term. Um, whether I do or not, I don't think I'm gonna do long term videos f for one video game in particular, but I want to make videos for a game that people will enjoy. So that's why I'm, I think I'm going to go towards like maybe you, you've seen some of my Minecraft stuff. Minecraft is a game I've been playing for honestly like 10 years. It is crazy to think that. I've been still playing the game, but it is still fun. It is still crazy to see new things in this game. It, I mean, to me, it's just like, it's nice to be able to make some Minecraft content. Uh, Super Auto Pets. That, is, that game is probably my favorite at the moment. It is so fun. I've been playing for three, four months. Holy crap, you guys have to go try it out. It's not for everyone, okay? It's a strategy game. It is cute animals fighting each other. 
<laughs> I mean, that, that that's pretty much it. You guys will see what I mean if you download it. I will definitely be making videos at some point on this game. Um, I'm gonna be making some Mech Arena. Although I know Mech Arena is also another mobile game that's pay to win, so I don't want to do it long term that much uh, either. Um, finally, probably some chess stuff. And honestly, whatever I want to be playing, I'm gonna be making videos probably. So expect some crazy things in the future. I don't expect any everyone in my audience to keep watching my videos. Obviously, I understand it. If you've been following me for Frag, you you don't have. I mean. You probably don't want to be watching my Minecraft videos or something, but if you do, uh, it, it, it would be great to see you uh, in the comments still. Um, again, I want to thank you guys for all of the love, all of the support in the comments, all of the ideas, um, all the things that you've been, all the things that you've been able to put forward for, for the channel and for me, I truly appreciate. Um, yeah, that's what I've been wanting to tell you. Hopefully this video is not going to be too long and too boring. Uh, I know monologues can be <laughs> a bit uh, when there's nothing to watch. Uh, outside of just like the guy speaking, it may be a little boring for you guys. But um, yeah, I I've said what I wanted to say. And honestly, look, if you're still watching, I kind of encourage you to quit the quit frag as well. You don't have to be a content creator to, to, uh, to just stop playing the game. I mean, look. Frag can be addicting, but once you stop playing the game, like stop playing daily, open chest, and get rewards from the events, that sort of stuff, it becomes a whole lot easier to, to take a step back and think, man, I've been wasting my time on this game, sort of, you know? Like, I, you might, like, it really, that's how I feel a little bit. Um, so I want to go with, you know, play games that I can enjoy and that you know put me in a better mood mood at the end of the day as much for you know making content as it is just for playing it so yep anyway guys I'm, i need to stop talking man this is just a, a channel update uh thank you for thank you for everything uh it was a whole lot of fun hope you stick around it's okay if you don't and um yeah see you around or maybe not Ciao.